When your pet needs urgent care, you need animal emergency care. Staffed with caring veterinary professionals with a state-of-the-art facility. Open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week for emergencies only. Animal Emergency Care in Bellingham and online at animalemergencycare.net. Cafe 104.1, Dave, Alan, and Patrice, it's time to meet this week's Cafe Critter, and oh my gosh, adorable. Oh, I love this little puppy. (laughs) Oh, it's adorable. He just licked in my mouth. (laughs) Oh, yeah, yeah. Good morning. (laughs) Did you bring this one for me to take home, Laura? Scooby Doo Walker. Oh, Scooby Doo, is that his name? Scooby Doo. Oh, that is is just a fun, beautiful little pup. What a great dog. A little bit mouthy at this point. Got to learn not to be so mouthy. He's a little bit of a disaster, let's just be honest. (laughs) How old is he? He is about three months old. He came in as a stray. We don't have any idea his history. Um, his breed, well, that's a good question. I call him a brown dog. He's mm-hmm. big brown okay. dog. Mm-hmm. Sure. Uh, Patrice, is he a good kisser? Oh, he's very good kisser. Very sweet. Oh, and okay. A little mouthy. Oh, he couldn't be happier. He is the happiest dog. He, do you know what, you know what to do with a puppy uh, when they get mouthy I on you? I just put like my that? hand in and, and force it to stop. You, you can do that. But yeah. the way to communicate uh-huh. to him that, that hurts you uh. is to yelp like a puppy. Oh, okay. You give him one of those, and they, and they realize, oh, that was too much. <laughs> So okay. he is, I had to learn that with my dog. Yeah, he is super mouthy. So he's a puppy that probably has not had, as you can see, not even probably, he just hasn't had any training. Puppy obedience school is going to be vital for this little guy. Sure. Because right now it's really cute. Oh, he puts his he puts your hand in his mouth, he puts yes. your shoe in his mouth, he thinks that everything is a chew toy. It's cute now when he's eight months old and sixty pounds, it's not gonna be yeah. so cute. Right. So when he ruins your favorite shoes. Exactly. But Alan, you know what? What we've always said about dog training. Yeah, exactly. Uh, uh, train, don't uh, experience the pain. Uh, yes. I've, I've always said that. that I've is always fantastic, said fantastic, Alan. Yes. So we train with affection, not correction. Yes, I've, known, I've been known to do that as well. Yes, yeah. so positive reward-based puppy school is going to be vital for this little guy. One, new things kind of freak him out. So he walked in here, he barked at you yeah. guys. Yeah. It was like, well, stranger sure. danger. But then he figured it out. So the great thing about puppy school is... It's going to socialize him with other dogs. He's going to learn that when you put another dog's paw in your mouth, that other dog's going to turn around and go, no, we don't do that. Uh He's going to meet new people. He's going to meet new things. He's going to experience life. And then he's going to grow up to be a fantastic dog. He's going to hit that juvenile delinquent stage where you're going to want to just go, oh, my gosh, what have I done? And then it's all going to be worthwhile. Right now, (laughs) leashes are in his mouth. Everything goes in his mouth. He's a puppy. If you have the time and energy and patience and sense of humor to yeah. raise what's probably going to be about a 60 to 70 pound um, dog lab retriever something mix, this is your guy. What He's very sweet. Dog. Just saying, Dave Walker. Uh, Just saying. If I was in the market, man, I'd take this guy home mm-hmm. right now. He, it, it, is he part of a litter? Are there others? No, he came in solo. Really? Yeah. Weird. I know. Some, and somebody just came in and dropped him yep. off? He was a, a bound wow. stray, so he has the sweetest little face, uh-huh. the most yeah. expressive eyes. Well, he's just so happy. He's going to, you know, there's something about that puppy energy. Life yep. is yeah. a puppy. Yeah. Huh. It's Adorable. a good life. Yeah. It really is. He's a little past the puppy smell face. Yes. Mm-hmm. And yes, big important thing to remember, before he goes home, he's going to be neutered. He's going to be microchipped. He's going to be vaccinated. So he's going to be ready to go. Awesome. It, now, is he potty trained yet? No. <laughs> okay. mm. At right. any he's, moment, there could be three potty months. on my he's lap. He's working on it, though. <laughs> right. okay. He's working on He's trying really hard. Oh, wait, okay. he's working on what? <laughs> <laughs> right now, is he working on it? Or what's happening right now? <laughs> Oh you're boy. fine, Scooby. Oh. No, you're fine. Okay. <laughs> Look at that tail wag. <laughs> that is Zoink, Scoob. Oh, adorable. Okay. All right. <laughs> you can right, turn well, him over to Dave if you want, Patrice. Go, Dave. That way. Dave, Dave oh, finds boy. puppies charming. I there love go. puppies. Have a little Scooby Dooby Doo. There you go. Okay. Okay. Just tangle your headphone here. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, what boy. could go wrong? There we go. Okay. There we go. Gotcha. Right, gotcha. Woo. That was a workout, <laughs> man. Yeah. Just hold Notice him I walked in and just turned him over and yeah. stepped Which back. Which is great. That's yeah. what we, that's what I like you to do because then I get a little puppy time. But, man, he's a, he's a cutie. Boy. He's a lot. You're, he is a lot. Good boy. 
Very sweet dog. Lots of puppies, lots of dogs all available at the Humane Society right now. You were by the other day to take a look around and you can attest to that. I I went in on Friday and took a little tour of the Humane Society and I saw a dog get adopted and I tell you what, the family was crying. I I didn't even know the family or the dog, but I started crying. My mom was crying. It was just like when you see a dog find their human and those humans were... Um, you know, they were so grateful to have that dog connection. And when the dog first came out of the kennel, um, it was it was shy. You could tell like the tail was tucked between its legs. And then when it got into the room with its humans, by the time we had walked by a second time, the dog was up on the human's lap, just licking their faces. And just you could tell like the dog had gone from uh, alone, scared, you know, feeling yeah. un- unsure in the kennel to like, I have people. And they went outside for a little walk. And it was just, it was a very emotional experience to witness that happen at the Humane Society That's on Friday. Cool. It was super cool. That's the good part of what you see. It's why you we see do, both sides. Yep. It's why we do what we do. It yeah. keeps us going. It's fuel. Yeah. Really oh, yeah. It is. Oh, yeah. For sure. Yeah. It was great. Yeah. Well, if you're in the market for a puppy, Scooby Doo available now at the. I- at the Watkins Humane <laughs> Society. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. You're, you're a little mouthy, buddy. you got to learn that one. you got a lot of stuff you got to learn yet. Yeah. Uh, Cafe Critters is brought to us by Animal Emergency Care and Boundary Bay Veterinary Hospital. When your pet gets sick or has an emergency, it's scary. Finding help doesn't have to be. Always open 24 hours a day, seven days a week, including holidays, on Meridian in Bellingham and at animalemergencycare.net. Laura Clark from the Watkins Humane Society. Thank you so much. Have a great week.